What's up everybody, Nycove the Fox here, and I come here today with a happy update, something that is positive to start off 2021. So if you have been paying attention behind me, I don't know if you can tell, but there is something very special behind me, a little surprise. So after about two years now, I think it's been, I finally decided to adopt again, and I got myself a new baby. You guys could probably guess what it, what this surprise is, what this child is. If you have been watching my channel for a couple years at least, you will have known that I have owned a female Rex Rabbit in the past and she was very sassy and very spunky. Are you guys excited to see the new baby? I should just show you the new baby. Are you ready to see the new baby? I'm sure you are. You're probably saying, hey, shut the hell up and show me the baby. That's all I'm here for. Ta-da, baby! Do it again. Stick, stick your face up, come here. Ta-da, baby! And he's gone. <laughs> Look at how cute you are. You have, you have a big chunk of bedding on you though. So everyone meet Timmy. He is a male lion head and he is only seven months old, so he is a baby. You can't really see his face past his emo bangs and him shoving his mouth into the bedding to try and eat this little carrot bit, but uh, when he finally shows his face, he's pretty cute. <laughs> the rest of him just kind of looks like he's been electrocuted. But it, it's fine. Look at that handsome face. Also, if you notice, he has blue eyes, which I have never in my life seen on a rabbit. Ever. Hi, are you coming out? I mean, you can if you want. I just gotta make sure you don't go anywhere because I <laughs> have not baby-proofed this room. And I don't know what you're capable of, you beast. This is Timmy. He's a little blurry probably in, from this angle. And he is very sweet. He's spunky. He's got an attitude, which I think all rabbits do to some degree. But he is perfect in every way. Are you coming out? You gotta let me know so that I know if I need to go into mommy mode and make sure you don't like run rampant and destroy things. Cause you could be a little monster and I wouldn't know yet cause I've only had you for two days. You've got so much bedding stuck to you and they warned me about that because you're a lion head, so everything's gonna stick to you. So, once upon a time, I was going to PetSmart to take in my old man, stinky kitty. His name is Milo, he's not, he's not stinky. Well, he, he's a little stinky, but like figuratively stinky. But he is my baby. He was the first cat I ever personally owned as a kid and I've grown up with him, and at this point, that means he is very, very old for a cat. So he developed a thyroid issue. So we took him to the vet and got that handled. While I was waiting for my, my old man, Milo, to get done with his appointment, I was like, hey, let's just like walk around the store, kill some time, you know, I don't know, look, look, look at the babies that they have right now, cause you know, they always have new babies out. So they were like, a few animals out. There was like maybe one bird. I thought there was only one, but then it turns out his friend was just, you know, loafing in the water dish, hiding from the world. And then from afar, way in the distance, it wasn't that far in the distance because I was already in the rodent section, but in the distance, <laughs> I saw this white fluffy creature in a box, in a glass box. And I was like, what is that? And immediately, as soon as I got close enough, I saw two little long ears and I was like, oh my God, it's a rabbit. And the first thing this little guy did when he made eye contact with me was come up to the glass, get up on his two little hind legs and put his paws on the glass. And he just looked at me like right in the eyes. And I was like, oh my God. He's perfect in every way. I mean, his blue eyes, first of all, like I was shocked when I looked at him for the first time and I saw that he had blue eyes. I was like, can rabbits have blue eyes? I was like, I didn't even know that. Miracle baby. Boop. And then just when I thought he couldn't get any more perfect, he does this little like ninja kick wiggle and goes over to his litter box. And then he does this like dramatic hair flip and then his little, his little lion mane bangs just kind of like fall in front of his face. And then he looks all emo. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God. Like the longer I watched him 
the more I fell in love with him. And then I read his little his little adoption sign, and it was like, hi, my name is Timmy. And I was like, oh my God, his name is Timmy. I need Timmy. I don't know why, but I need Timmy. Like I've never ever seen a bunny that looks so perfect. I've seen a lot of f***ed up rabbits, okay? <laughs> I've seen plenty, but you are a beacon of hope for rabbits. He, I think he's eating his own sh but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I mean, really, there's an easier, there's an easier way if you just eat the stuff that's already down. You see? <laughs> Big brain. <laughs> His name is Timmy, by the way. I think I've said that already like probably 10 times, but it's fine. But yeah, his name is Timmy, um, which was actually the name that he already had on his adoption papers. However, I don't know if I want to stick with that name. The other thing is I'm struggling to come up with a name for this little fella. So if you guys have any cute little name suggestions for this new babe, oh, hello. Hi, for this new little baby. Let me know down in the comments and I may just pick your name. Oh, hi, did I get a boop? That was so nice. I wasn't even paying attention. Thanks for the boop. What you doing? You thinking about coming out? I almost rolled up this carpet because I was afraid that you might try and eat it, but I thought that maybe you'd be smarter than that. So I'm giving you the benefit of the doubt. <gasps> He's out! Hello! He made it! Hello! He's escaped. What will he do? What sins will he commit? Look at all the betting on your lion mane butt. Ugh, that's exactly where I said not to go, because there's cords. There he goes. Ta-da! A blurry bunny for your viewing pleasure. He's actually very good with being held as long as you support his butt. I can feel your little heart racing so much. Take a deep breath, buddy. He is all wound up now because he got to explore. He's like, oh, hi. Are we cuddling or are you trying to eat my hair? I'm gonna go with cuddling. Not that he's trying to eat my weave. Here, let's get a good thumbnail. Look at his little beans. I will stop harassing you now. Oh, look at him. He wants out now, now that he knows. Look at him. He's like, let me out. He's got a long bath ahead of him, apparently, after all that adventure. He's like, woo, it is time to be clean. But yeah, that's basically it, but Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed meeting the new baby. I'm so excited to have him. Oh, he's so cute. And I can't wait to see if I can like maybe teach him a few little tricks or something cause he's a baby. So he's still fresh. Dang, was I really that smelly? He's like, ugh, you touched me. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and comment. Leave a lovely comment for this little fellow. Tell him how much you love him and how much you want to cuddle him, because I know you do. Also, does this mean that Vanessa will have a pet rabbit in the film series? Hell yeah, it does. It's done, he's the star. No more Vanessa, it's Timmy's show. Timmy into madness, coming soon. Vanessa into Madness still has a lot of work to be done. But yeah, that is all for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Again, reminder, leave your name suggestions for little Timmy in the comments and I would love to see them. And always remember, stay bright because you're a star and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.